Well, for weeks, the Biden administration has promised more baby formula is on its way to the U.S. Yeah, we report about those shipments from overseas pretty often, and we wanted to see if the formula was actually back on the shelves. CBS 17's Gilat Balamid is live for us tonight after digging deeper into this. Gilat? This Costco has dozens of bulk boxes of formula, a big change from when we came here in May, and they were completely out of formula that day. We revisited eight stores in Raleigh and Cary that we went to seven weeks ago to see if the formula situation changed. Six-month-old Gavin Way loves his hypoallergenic Gerber. We're getting um, Gerber a lot, actually. But sometimes it'll have it like in stores. Mom Brittany Way says she still has to call stores in advance to see what's in stock, but can usually find what she needs. She switched formula brands after we first met her seven weeks ago because Nutramagen was too hard to find, leaving her feeling stress and anxiety. Because I wanted, you know, my baby to eat, but he couldn't. Um, but now he eats like a lot. He eats like a lot. <laughs> and he's six months. So he eats a lot of formula. But I'm so much happier now. It was hard for us to find new Tramogen when we checked out supply in mid-May. It's still not widely available, but we saw some more than last time, with some at Wegmans in Raleigh, Walgreens on New Bern Avenue, and about two dozen cans at Walmart in Cary. Back in May, Wegmans in Raleigh was one of the only places we saw Enfamil, a single box. Now we found Enfamil at most stores we went to. Last month, the closed Abbott Nutrition Factory restarted production. Are things today better than they were three weeks ago? Yeah, I think so. There are still large bare spots on store shelves, but this is the difference at Target and Carry. Dozens more small Similac 360 bottles and about two dozen large Candomil jars. Candomil is a European brand that's been distributed to Target's through Operation Fly Formula. On Wednesday, the Biden administration announced there will be two more deliveries of Candomil this month, totaling about 200,000 pounds. Signs limiting formula are reminders the situation is not resolved, but for Way, it is an improvement. I'm just happy that, you know, he can eat and, and we're good now. Some brands are still tough to find. The state health department does not have numbers on how much formula we've received from the federal government here in North Carolina. The health department says that that formula goes directly to stores and health care providers. I've been Raleigh Gilat Malamed, CBS 17 News. All right, Gilat, thank you.